there are many strong women in our lives. You're right. Mother, sisters, aunts, friends. And yes, let us not forget our very own teachers here in 5-1 Talk. In tonight's special episode, we're going to be meeting our very own teachers who, as a woman with their strength, compassion, and kindness, made their loved ones li- their loved ones' lives a lot brighter. Okay, so are you all ready to meet our strongest women teachers? Be motivated and proud of them as they will wow you with the stories of their lives. Okay, so let's meet the women women who who lead. lead. Okay, let's start and meet our women teachers who will be our guests for tonight. Hello, teachers. We're glad to have you here. Please turn on your cameras. Hi, teacher. Welcome to the Yellow Tomorrow Show, teachers. Thanks for joining us this evening. Hello, teachers. Macy Ray, Odette Shiva, and Joy Sia. Thank you for joining us tonight. Teachers, why don't you introduce yourselves to ours tonight? Teacher Odette Shiva. Hello everyone, my name is Teacher Odette Shiva and I am a housewife, a vlogger, and a 5-1 Talk teacher for almost 10 months. And I can say that I am a wonder woman because I can be a wonder to my family, to my followers, and to my students all the time. Yes, thank you. We're so glad to have a very own Wonder Woman here tonight with us. And for our, we'd like to get to know you better. Can you share with us what are the qualities of an empowered woman? So for this, let's start with Teacher Odette Shiva, and then this will be uh, she will be followed by Teacher Joyce Fia, and lastly with Teacher Macy Ray. Teacher Odette, um, go ahead. Okay. <laughs> I feel like I feel like I'm joining our beauty pageant again, <laughs> and this is the question and answer mm-hmm. part. Okay. Um, for me, the qualities of an empowered woman, basically, they don't take crap from anyone (laughs) they stand tall on their own and don't let anything ruffle their feathers like trees withstanding a terrible storm also for me a empowered and empowered women they know their worth and their value and they don't let anyone squash it Mm -hmm. so i think that's it (laughs) <laughs> wow! Ibigay na ba natin ang corona kay Teacher <gasps> I'd love that, Miss Angela, please. <laughs> okay, but we still have to have listen another to question. Okay, because you're all very good in answering our Miss Universe questions. questions. Okay, right. so we want to hear some more. So we will be empowered and inspired. So for the next question, before 5-1 talk, ayan, we have to uh, go on our time machine. Before 5-1 Talk, what was your passion in life? Let's start with Teacher Odette Shiva. Thank you for that wonderful question again, Ms. Angela. (laughs) Okay, before becoming a housewife and prior to 5-1 Talk, I was so active in different things. So from being an HR, I became a preschool teacher for two years. Mm. I also became an operations manager for this clothing line. For Visayas in Mindanao, I studied culinary, I became a marketing analyst, I studied barista, then I I opened up my own business, and I was also involved in a philanthropic organization. You see, I was traveling, I was everywhere, because I just... I want to be I want to create positive change. I want to be of service to others mm. because I have this motto in life kasi that everything I do be it small or big, simple or complex, I make sure that I always do my best and I thank you. Wow. <laughs> Good evening. Well, then that's 2022. <laughs> what's in your bag? We'd like to see teachers. What's inside your bag? These must be uh, there. I mean, there must be things that you need during your lessons or on your rest days. That's just in there. You mga things that alam nyo pagka hinugot nyo talagang ayro siya, school siya. Yes, ang magagamit. Yes, as teachers, we must bring the necessary tools. Yeah, si Max nasa bag parate. <laughs> that can help our ste- teachers better learn the English language. But of course, when we think of bags, we think of the everyday objects that help us be ready for any situation. Right. Now, now next up, teacher Odette Shiva, show us what's in your bag. 
Okay, so when the pandemic started, I decided to have a pandemic bag as well. So this is the only bag I use every time I go out because I don't want to get any viruses outside the house, okay? And the things that I have inside, okay, I'll show you the first one, of course... We all have this alcohol. So yes. even before pandemic, even before COVID, I always bring alcohol with me because germs and viruses are not my friends because of my allergic rhinitis. So better safe than sorry. <laughs> this one. And of course, this one. Very helpful as a housewife and as a teacher. I always have my pen and notepad with me sticky notes because as a housewife I always list down all the things that I need to do especially during day offs or during groceries I write down all the necessary stuff to buy and as a teacher I always do my evaluation I make an evaluation note here in my notepad so very very important and oops there's an interesting <laughs> this is my internet receipt bill. So as we all know, this is our, I mean, internet connection is our lifeline right now. Especially, not just for me and not just for us teachers, but to all the mothers out there, right, Teacher Macy Ray? Because uh, our, your kids are having online classes. So yes. I don't want to compromise my work. As an online English teacher, so my student depends on me. And if I have a very good connection, stable connection, nagiging ga magana ako magturo, and that's what makes me empowered and happy. Oh, happy? happy? Sad. Mad. Or mad. Mm -hmm. For our guests tonight, all you have to do is to just react to the situation that we will give you, okay? So you will just listen to the situation and show us a happy, sad, or mad emoticon. Yes, so we'll be giving you that particular situation. This could be anything um, from your family life, love life, work life, or others. So you better prepare yourselves, teachers. Okay, so, so wait. for the second situation, this is for teacher Adet Shiva. Get ready with your emoticons. So this is your situation. You're stuck in traffic and you're about to be late for your lesson at home. Quick, teacher Adet Shiva, flash your emoticon right now. Oh, no. <laughs> Sad. This would be my initial reaction because I don't want to be late in my class. Who wants that, right? But after this sad emoticon, I will be happy. I will learn to smile mm -hmm. because we should learn to smile at any given situation. And I will come to realize that in every situation, there will be opportunities to think and mm -hmm. reflect. And also, I will make this um, the situation be... Um, uh, I will get strength and um, be be happy because at the end of the day, it's still you. It's it's up to us, right? So yeah, that's it. Okay, thank you so much, Teacher Odette. Again, if and yes, teachers, do you have any final words of wisdom to give to our viewers who are just watching us from home? How about you, Teacher Odette Shiva? Okay, um, I would before anything else, I would just like to say thank you so much to the whole team of the Yellow Tomorrow Show for inviting me for tonight's episode. I feel so honored. Sana maulit. <laughs> and of course, to our two beautiful hosts, Ms. Ingrid, Ms. Angela, thank you so much for a very fun and lively show as always. And yes, to all my co-teachers and to all the beautiful, strong, empowered women who are watching right now, let us remain to stay positive in these trying times. We can't live in a positive life with a negative view of the world, right? So let's make positive thinking. Uh, let's shift our perspective to a positive thinking because it will help us to do best at any given situation. So let us all utilize the power of positive thinking in our daily lives. Let us be the source of light not just to our family and friends, but also to our students and to our students' family as well. So continue to do you and be you, girl. <laughs> Thank you so much. Do you and be you, girl. <laughs> Thank you. We appreciate your words. 